Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're playing Detroit Become Human. I am super, super, super excited for this game. I've been waiting for this game to come up for ages. I'm just, I'm so excited to get started with it. Quick shout out to Sony, thank you so much for sending me the code. I'm very appreciative and I'm so grateful that I get given the opportunity to play this game a day early. So guys, let's get into the gameplay. Mwah. Hello. Welcome Working to the Detroit experience. Graphics. I'm an android and I'll be your hostess. Before we begin, let's make some adjustments to optimize your experience. These language settings were detected on your console. Are they correct? Yes. Please adjust your screen settings. Okay. Um, yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Now select your profile. This is mad. Ex casual experience. Yeah, experienced. Yes. When this sign is displayed, please do not turn off your console. You are now ready to begin Detroit. Remember, this is not just a story. This is our future. I've got fucking chills. I got chills, guys. Like, literal chills. I'm so excited. <laughs> August 15th, Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm so excited. I think I played this part actually at a demo at EGX. Please, please, you gotta save my little girl. Wait, you're sending an android? All right, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. You. Why aren't you sending a real person? Find Captain Allen. Captain Allen, where are you? Awesome. Okay, so he's over here. I don't give a shit. My men are ready to step in. Just give the order. Hey, Captain Allen, I'm gonna need to speak to you. What's good? <laughs> Captain Allen, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Do you know if it's been behaving strangely before this? I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Do you know its name? Listen. Saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Oh no. <laughs> 48 percent. Okay, hang on. What am I looking at here? Okay. Right, we've got to analyze as much as possible, guys, so we can have a higher probability of saving the little girl. Steven took the fire gun. Okay. Okay, we're at 51%. What else can we look at? This has a button you can press. Search Hostess' room, okay. I guess it's this little girl's room. Fifty 
I right now, I fucking miss that. Ugh. Okay, we've searched the room. At least I think we have. Is that everything? Right, what are we missing here? I just get out going over and acting like triggering a cutscene. Examine the victims. Right, what can we analyse? Fatal abdominal trauma. Lower lung hemorrhage. Lead to eternal bleeding. Lung hemorrhage. Where was it? I looked at that one. Deceased. He was holding on to something. Rewind to search for a new clue. What was he holding on to? Where did it go? Landed over there. Taking too long. Oh, cool! He just pushes a chair, and that's pretty cool. By all signs, the SWAT team are preparing for an assault, and it's been just over an hour since a little girl was taken hostage on the top floor of a building here in downtown Detroit. Details are still emerging on what exactly happened, but the hostage shaker could be the family's android. What are we missing? This cop? Right, what are we looking for? Deceased. Residue. Right heart ventricle perforated. Gordon's a gun under the table. Sixty nine percent. Take or put back. Oh, <laughs> um, 
we take it just in case? Put back. They said androids are strictly forbidden in carrying any weapons, so I don't want to risk it. Fuck out of maybe jump. Locate the hostage. Well, that's cool. We're not looking at this Buddha. Well, the hostage is outside. <laughs> We only got 69% though. What are we waiting for? We should take down this asshole. Android's wounded. Seventy-one percent. That's not very high. There's got to be something else we can look at. What the fuck are you doing? You gotta talk to the boy. Well then, I guess I have no choice. Here we go. Look. <laughs> um. Ow. Don't come any closer, or I'll jump. You, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me. I thought she loved me, but I was wrong. Okay, he's going she's green. just like all the other humans. Daniel, no. They were going to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. But I was just there toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. Listen. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No. It's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them. You know? But I was nothing to them. <laughs> Just a slave to be ordered around. I can't stand that noise anymore. Tell that helicopter to get out of here. Piss off, helicopter. I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. My hands are all sweaty. <laughs> to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go and I promise you everything will be fine. I want everyone to leave! And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go and I promise you won't be hurt. I don't want to die. You're not going to die. You're just going to talk. Nothing will happen to you. You have my word. Okay. <sighs> I trust you. Okay. Oh, you trusted me. He's still got the freaking gun in his hand. 
You lied to me, Connor. You lied to me. When I first did this demo, that was not the ending I got. I self-sacrificed the first time. <laughs> Such a cool beginning! This is the scene's flowchart. He can review the paths you've taken, the paths you have to be explored, and what possibilities you've unlocked. Each node earns you points that you send in the extras. That you can spend in the extras. Due to the nature of the game, some notes and earnings will not be counted towards the completion of the flowchart. Okay, so we went this route. So mission start, talked to Alan, we did all that we could for such clues, but we left the cop's gun. We did waste too much time <laughs> and the SWAT was injured, but we confronted the deviant outside. We had the friendly approach and dismissed the helicopter. Um, we got close enough, but we lied to the deviant, but we did build trust. And sniper shot him. World stats. So 30%, 30%, 42%. That's cool. You can see everyone else's stats. Only 12% left the cop's gun. Okay. Continue. November 5th, 2038. This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. 200 lunches and diners. And handles the kids' oh, homework from elementary school up to university. Damn. Honey, it looks amazing. Like At the moment, we're doing a special promotion on this entire what are we range. looking for? At $7,999 with a 48 months interest. It does absolutely for parts and labor. Painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs. At night, it switches to surveillance mode and contacts emergency services if there's a break in or pre owned. Oh, pre owned. Oh, these ones got rejected and taken back. Many of the functions. Come along and I'll show you. I don't like this guy. Oh, I'll trigger that guy. What about me? Am I good? There it is. Oh no, back and I reckon I see him in the trailer. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. Stupid accident. Ah, uh, I see. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it. Meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. It'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. Kara. My name is Kara. Yeah, we've we've seen this pairing in in the trailer. This game is beautiful so far. Soundtrack's really nice as well. I'm really excited to see where this game goes. I lost my job because of Android.
<laughs> okay, November 5th, 2038. 9.38 a.m. He looks like the guy from Scrubs. I'm not Scrubs, yes. from Grey's Anatomy. Yes, I, think that's I go to Bellini Paint Shop. Here. Let me help you. Huh. If there's anything else I can do. You can't run in this either, so we're gonna have a casual, nice little walk to the paint shop. This game is am oh, it's amazing. <laughs> I honestly just want to binge this so hard, but Dark Souls released today as well. Remastered, so your girl's gotta do that as well, unfortunately. Where is it? Where's the shop? Oh, over here. Beep, beep. Oh, I love the little skip as well. When he's crossing the road, that's cool. I always do that as well when I'm crossing a crossing. That's rude. Very nice. Alright, 41 meters down here. There's someone preaching here. Ban androids. Hey bitch, I'm right here! That's just rude. Here we go. Bel Bellini paints. Even just the water on the floor and its reflection. Ooh, this is a cute shop. Identification verified. Here is your order number 847. That will be 6399. Please confirm payment. Payment confirmed. Mad. Transaction complete. Thanks. Sick, right, well, I'll see you later, then I'm gonna get the bus home now. Where's the bus? That way, okay. Right guys, let's go hit the bus home, excuse me lady. I wonder what these paints are for. Is there a child back home? I guess we're gonna find out. But I wonder if the actor is actually the guy from Grey's Anatomy. I'm gonna look this up. Yeah, this way. Get yours today. Would you guys get an Android if you could? I don't know if I could, would or not. Like, I don't know. It would scare me. Artificial oh, intelligence. Yeah, all right, I get it. I'm right here. Okay, you don't need to friggin' shout it in my face. Yeah! Well, then you should be better at your jobs then. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're at the bus stop. Android area. Well, I haven't seen any ugly Android yet. Okay, shades of colour. So we could have had actually different routes there. But I did like listen to the busker and stuff like that. It wasn't like major, you could change the ending of it. World stats. 63% listen to the busker, lovely. So I definitely need to look around more, I think. Definitely need to look around more. Because there's loads of stuff we could have done there, but I just didn't. I just went to the paint shop and took the bus home. 
But don't worry, guys, I'm not going to be rushing through it. I just didn't realise there could be so many different options when you just do something like a simple task like that. So, do not worry. November 5th, 2038. It's music from the trailer and we're back with the scary man! Join Todd. I don't particularly want to. He's a scary man. You just get a horrible vibe off him. You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of. God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Brat's also called Alice. Alice! Alice! What a sick name! It's just spelled differently. Oh, <laughs> That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. So she got destroyed last time by Todd, who supposedly accidentally ran her over. Right, scan the environment. Urgent task, optional task, okay. Right, let's do the urgent tasks in here. Yeah. I don't want to mess with him, so. Maybe. Depends on what you need. We're gonna be doing all this as fast as possible, so he doesn't get mad. Yeah, yeah, I can get that. Yeah, yeah. I'll bring it tomorrow. Yeah, same place. You know, you know where. Let's take out the trash. I mean, it would be nice to have a help like this, to be honest. I hate taking out the fucking trash. And it always, the bin always ends up like overflowing. Okay, we've done that urgent task. People chilling on the bus. Fuck, man. Report to Todd. Todd, come here. Todd. We having a hit there, are we? I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. All right, fucking hell. Have a hit and calm down. Out of the way, for fuck's sake! I'm sorry, Todd. It won't happen again. Jesus Christ, he is horrible. Oh my God, I want to smack him. I fucking will at some point. Guarantee it, guys. You guys know I ain't gonna take no fucking shit. I'm gonna save this little girl. At least I better do. I'm gonna be so mad at myself. <laughs> Don't want to read that. We need to tidy. Actually, fuck it. Ah, oh, wouldn't let me. Huh. Put that down. Weird book. Did I make the bed? It does not look made. That's such a cute little girl. I 
to clean this bloody mess up. He consumes a lot of alcohol. Not surprising, though. Okay. Don't want to switch that on. Oh, ventilate. Ah! <laughs> That's so cool! <laughs> So easily amused. Right, where's the rest of the mess? Are you missing something? Antidepressant. Oh great, he has a gun as well. Well, at least we know he has a gun. <laughs> what else do you need to tidy up? I haven't done all of it. Clean mess. Switch this on. And now to sports. Now nah, turn off. What haven't we tidied up? There's got to be something. Here we go. Just these papers on the side. So we've got to make sure we're really thorough. We could have missed that gun really easily. But we're not allowed to yield weapons as androids. So. Watch it. Rude bitch. Alright, let's clean these areas. Oh my god, this is so grim. <laughs> Alright, we gotta mop the floor. What, what are we doing here? Ah! <laughs> the novelty! Never get bored of it. Never get bored of it. Tidy Alice's room. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? No, it's not, bitch! <laughs> Alright, make the bed. Ventilate and what? You okay? I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. What about your mother? Will she be home soon? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Shouldn't have mentioned her mother. <laughs> oh, God. Well, now I'm upset her. What was that? The key. Okay. Ask Todd for new instructions. Ooh.
what is this stuff? Pizza and the Android. else we need to grab or look at. Oh, What's this? Okay, I'm just gonna have a quick look around everywhere. Just to make sure there's nothing that we've missed or we can open or we can look at will help us in the future when we're clearly going to beat up that motherfucker. <laughs> We've done that room. Okay, let's go speak to Todd, see what he has to say next. Oh, Todd, you asshole. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. He's playing with a fucking cuddly toy! I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life? Probably because you are! Fucking loser. Can't get a job, take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. I, mean, I, you I hate wouldn't me blame her. You. Say it! You hate me! God. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. Okay. Welcome home. Okay, so these are all the paths that we took. Um, let's go back to the beginning. So, clean first floor. We joined Todd. We disturbed Todd. Took out the trash. We asked to go upstairs. We went upstairs. We tidied the pillows and we saw the gun. We cleaned the room, the toilet. Alice goes to her room. We cleaned Alice's room, bed -like room, and we discovered a way down. The God, we didn't do any more of these on the first floor. Fuck. We should have had a look around more. So Alice is the neutral opinion about me right now. Okay guys, I'm actually going to be ending that episode there and continue this on in the next episode. If you enjoyed it, smash <laughs> remember to smash that like button if you haven't already, hit subscribe and the notification button to notify whenever I upload. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Just run away with my darling.